This is Mark with HowToWindows and HowToOutlook.com. Check out our websites for the latest tips and tricks. There's a link in the description. Today I will show you how to download, install, and dual boot Windows Developer Mode, which is codenamed Windows 8. The first step is to type in the search computer, then click computer management at the top. Next, click disk management. Now right click the main disk and press shrink volume. This program works in megabytes, so go to the website in the description and convert the gigabytes wanted into megabytes. Now type in the amount of gigabytes you want. Make it at least 35 gigabytes. Copy and paste the conversion into the program. Once copied, press shrink. Once it has completed shrinking, right click the newly created partition and press new simple volume. Press next, leave the megabytes the same, then press next. Now assign a letter to the drive. I made it W for Windows 8. You can make it anything that is available. Next, name the volume anything that is recognizable. I name it Windows 8 for the new windows. Make sure all the settings are correct, then press finish. Once it finishes formatting, go to the website in the description, labeled download link. Now unless you are an advanced user, then I would only focus on these two downloads. Now find out which system type you have, either 32 or 64 bit. To do this, press start and pause at the same time. It should tell you in the middle next to system type. Next. Click the download link corresponding to your operating system. This can take time to download as the file is from 2.8 to 3.6 GB. Once you finish downloading the file, burn it to a DVD by right clicking it and press burn disk image. You must have a DVD burner and a blank DVD for this step. Next, double click the install in computer. Let it load, then choose go online to install updates. After it checks your PC, accept the agreement. Then choose to keep user accounts and personal files. If it tells you to delete or change anything, then do as it says. Then press Restart PC. Once it boots from the CD, press Next. Then press Install Now. Accept the agreement again. Then choose Custom or Advanced. Then select the drive we just created. Mine is named Windows 8, so it is easy to find. Press Next once it's selected. You can leave your computer for about an hour. It will install Windows, then restart a couple of times. Once this screen comes, you will need to choose which operating system you would like to go into. Choosing Windows Developer Mode will continue the installation. And now you will have the choice between Windows Developer Mode and Windows 7. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe.